my friends, how you doing today? I am doing better than I've done in a while. I got some stuff. I got some packages here. I got uh, packages that came in the mail. And if I don't open them up today, I'm going to burst. I'm gonna I'm gonna burst because I'm excited. And and I, I listen. If you watch my channel, you know I love to get me some packages. And, and for some reason, they come in every day. They're gonna come in every day until the money runs out. That's what that's what's gonna happen. So do me a favor, please hit that that uh, subscribe button so you in in the bell so you know when I get my packages. Because this isn't just about me getting packages. Okay, this is me about helping the consumer, helping my friends here on YouTube to be able to find the things that you're after. I am not a flipper. I am not trying to take advantage of you. I'm trying to help you in any way, shape, I, or form, any way, shape, and form, any way, shape, any way I can, because I want you to be able to achieve your goals and get the things that you want to get. Because, listen, I don't believe that physical media is dying, okay? I don't believe it's dying. I don't want to be one of those guys that says, yeah, you know, it's... A you know, it's kind of sad because, you know, pretty soon there ain't going to be no... There'll be no physical media if you ain't buying no physical media. That's what's going to happen. As long as there is a supply and demand situation going on, they will continuously keep selling us this stuff, okay? That's what I'm telling you. It's supply and demand, okay? If you if you stop buying physical media, they're going to stop making physical media. If you stop buying toothpaste, they'd stop making toothpaste. That's just the way life is. So I want to help you. That's why I'm here to help you. But the only way I can help you is if you subscribe and you hit the bell and we talk as we go. And, and Movies are memories, and I'm going to tell you what I've been up to, and I'm going to tell you some stories about what I purchased, why I purchased it, how I got it, and how cheap I got it, and how I can help you get it. <laughs> Thank you. You love me. You really love me. <laughs> we get all that? Okay, so... Let's put these packages down. I'm gonna go. Should I go with the? I, I always go with the. I'm gonna go with the wrapper. I'm gonna go with the wrapper. I got my shop shop scissors here that we're, we're giving as a special gift. Get gift. This is coming from uh, Atlanta, Georgia. Atlanta, Georgia, and guaranteed this is some kind of CD, Blu-ray, or something. So we have Amazon, Amazon Prime bag, which good job with that recycling and reusing there, my friends. Take care of the environment. Uh, and then they put the Blu-ray in a bag bag. And there's a copy of uh, the Archive Collection Night Shift. Night Shift starring Henry Winkler and Michael Keaton. It's a, it's a movie about uh, them starting a prostitution ring and uh, making some money, if I remember correctly, out of a mortuary? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's out of a mortuary, I want to say. And uh, they start making money. They hire some hookers and they start making... It's, it was one of the earlier Michael Keaton comedies and earlier Henry Winkler straight out of Fonzie Look, I'm not Fonzie anymore. Now I'm a uh, love broker. Love broker. <laughs> okay, as they as they like to call it in this movie. I have not seen this movie in ages. This is an upgrade from my clipper, slipper, slapper. Whoa, what is it? Um, clicker, cardboard, covered DVD. This is an upgrade. I want to see. I want to see if the upgrade was good. I have not seen this movie in years, so I wanted to upgrade my um my movie uh nice little thing there no digital code if there was it would be yours um but yeah night shift starring henry winkler have not seen that in ages um pretty happy about that this is very thin very thin and it's coming from uh lesberg do not bend do not okay why are you so worried about the bend? i hope this is something good because if you watch one of my other videos you saw i got something in the mail the other ah you know what props Props, my friend. If you watched one of my other videos, you saw that I received um, F9, the the ninth saga of uh, Fast and the Furious, which I have only watched Fast and the Furious 1, and then I Tokyo drifted away, and uh, and now, uh, but I've been collecting. I got Timo and Hobbs, or whatever it is there, and all, I got all the Fast and Furious, the big Fast and the Furious box set with the press the button and the the speedometer lights up and everything just because it was totally cool, but I've only watched part one. But then I wanted to get the new one and I ordered the 4K off this guy online. And for some reason, when he sent it to me, I did not get the slip cover. Whew. And to make a long story short, he wanted me to send it back, and which made no sense to me. I'm like, it would be much, much cheaper for you to send me the the slip cover. Just send me the slip cover. Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab this. Do not bend. It costs tip. Wow. Sorry there, uh, uh, Sorry, my friend. He wanted me. He wanted me to send back the the blue uh, the 4K Blu-ray, and he wanted to charge me like four dollars and uh, something to, to ship it back. And I, I'm like, just send me the, the. This is what it is. I got the I got the, the slipcover. That's what this is. This is the slipcover 
for uh, but he he paid four dollars and fifty uh, four dollars and forty five cents to ship the slip cover to me. I feel bad. I pay. I know. I, I'm pretty sure I pay like eight dollars or seven dollars and change to begin with just for the four K Blu Ray combo pack. And with the initial shipping, this this poor bugger didn't make any money off of me. He didn't make any. Listen, he's getting his he's getting his positive. Fee I feel bad. He's getting his positive feedback. I'm gonna see what I can do because this this is um. I I feel a little bad for him because you know I, I'm not a slip case slip cover, crazy guy. Okay, but if they tell me the slip cover is gonna be in there, I kind of, I kind of go by my purchases that way. I'm like, okay, well it's gonna have the DVD, Blu-ray, 4K, whatever, and slip cover, uh, included. And then when I get in, there's no slip cover. It's it's a little bit of a letdown. So I was a little bit let down, but for him to charge. Must have cost. I'm pretty sure it must have cost me like four dollars to ship the first four uh, K originally, and now it just cost me another four, almost five dollars. He, he he lost money on this this thing, and I I feel bad. I'm gonna I'm gonna check with my PayPal and see if I can do something about that. Cause it, you know what, not only is it Christmas time, but that's just the right thing to do. I mean, there was. I, I mean, even if I send them back a couple of dollars to do something, it's got to be something. Um, next thing I got here is from the Goodwill Books e Commerce. Uh, and sometimes, like I say all the time, goodwill is a hit or miss. They they promise you good quality stuff, and then sometimes you get the you get junk. Um, it's a it's a copy of uh, let's say it correctly, boys and girls, Chocolat, Chocolat, starring Johnny Depp. Welcome to my world, my friends. I am on a Johnny Depp kick. Okay, I am I am upgrading all of my DVDs and. Johnny Depp movies that I have never had any interest in seeing or wanted to see, I'm buying them now on Blu-ray. Every single... I started right from movie number one and moved right up to the last movie that he did. And Chocolat I have on DVD. I wanted to upgrade it because I'm upgrading every Johnny Depp title. And why, you might ask? Because I watched Sweeney Todd the other day and I didn't watch it before. I've seen it before, okay? I love Sweeney Todd top five musicals of all time johnny depp to me top probably top 10 actors that I, I i absolutely love and i was like why don't i have everything by johnny depp i mean fear and loathing you know uh, uh rum diaries blow i mean all, all these things the, the man has not done a movie that i've been like i'm disappointed that i bought that movie i never should have bought that movie this was a terrible movie i've not seen one yet i mean i don't own don juan Damaco. i was kind of i ordered it it's coming in you're gonna see it in one of these pickups but i had not ordered it but i was always deterred from don juan Damaco. why because the name of the movie is called don juan Damaco. okay and, it, and it's got a it's got a shirtless johnny depp on the front with a guy on one side i think and a girl on it if i remember correctly and i was like i got no interest for a don juan Damaco. but now i do because i am on the full kick of Johnny Depp, and I, I gotta get everything. I gotta get everything Blu-ray of Johnny Depp, and Chocolat is the first one that came in the mail. So please be advised that you are going to see a lot of Johnny Depp deposits, okay? There's gonna be Johnny Depp stuff coming in the mail. Uh, Chocolat, if you've never seen it, uh, I haven't seen it in years, so I'm gonna try to give you the synopsis on it, but I, I, I kinda, my mind's a little cloudy. It's about this girl, she runs a chocolate shop, and then uh, the Johnny Depp character comes in, but supposedly chocolate is the key to love okay like uh the um it's it's, it's in uh it's what i'm looking for come on oh I'm gonna, it's, it's a, a uh oh, not <laughs> oh what's the, um i got insomniac in my head it's not insomniac it's a aphrodisiac that's the word Somni insomniac it's an aphrodisiac it's supposedly chocolate supposed to make you make you feel like love you want to feel you, you want to find some love you know I mean? old people they eat some chocolate and they're like yeah i got I got the love again. You know, it's like, oh, and that's what this was all about. This lady runs a chocolate shop. Next thing you know, everybody's all in love. And, and all, all of a sudden, here comes the Johnny Depp figure, figure and now she's in love. You know, if, if I remember correctly, if not, comment below. That might not be anything that I might be totally off. I haven't seen it in a long time. Uh, and then we have, this is my last last little pickup here. We got a, okay, this is, uh to me, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Blu-rays in here. It's gotta be my. It's my guess. It's my guess because I feel them. Um, and this is coming from. This is coming from. Lightweight, time sensitive, Royal Drive, Kenshaw, Ken, Ken. Hey, whatever. Um, are they new? Is this, what is it? What is this? Wait a minute. These are not new. These are used. And what? What do we got here? Ah! <laughs> Proving me right once again. This is a Johnny Depp. 
uh, smorgasbord, okay? Yeah, we... Did I, did I, okay. Um, blue... Are, are you kidding me? Hang on one second, my friends. I'm getting a phone call again. Yeah. All right. Sorry, my friends. If I didn't edit that out, I'm back again. And yeah, it, it's it's a, a accumulation of Johnny Depp films, starting with The Rum Diaries. The Rum Diaries. I have not seen The Rum Diaries. What I My take on, on it was, it was kind of like a Fear and Loathing Part 2. Maybe I'm wrong about that. But I own it on DVD. Have not watched it yet. This is a new... Uh, I better check these while I'm going in because these are used. Um, I bought them all from the same guy. Yep, Rum Diaries. We got Rum Diaries in here. If there's any digital codes, I'll throw those at you as we go along. If they're used or not used. We have... Um, so so we Rum Diaries, okay? Here we go. Uh, then we have the... I'm going to say this wrong. Uh, Mordecai? Mordecai? Never seen it before. I know he plays this character, and I want to say uh, Yoga Hooges and, and Tusk, I want to say. I think he plays the same character in those two movies, which I already own Yoga Hooges and, and uh, am I saying that right? Yoga Hoses? Yoga Hooges or Yoga Hoses and Tusk. So you're not going to see an unboxing of that because they're already on the shelf. But um, he plays the same kind of character in this movie, and I have not owned this yet. Oh, we do have a digital code inside. And uh, if it still works, five. Four, three, my hands are shaky. Shaky hands today. Uh, there it is. I hope you enjoy Mordecai on uh, on uh, digital, if that still works. I don't know. Um, don't know anything about this. I, I want to say it's a, uh, from the commercials, I wasn't really interested. It was like a comedy, um, comedy, uh, comedy, not his, what, what am I, what am I looking for? What's the word I'm looking for? Comedy. Like a like a Sherlock Holmes like <laughs> comedy mystery yes com comedy mystery guy yeah that, that's that's what I'm oh please uh blow love this movie I have not seen this another one I haven't seen in a long time got it on on DVD didn't get it on Blu-ray uh if I remember correctly this brings back the Bobcat Gold I'm gonna say his name wrong Gold Goldwaith the Gold Cat Gold Cat. Bobcat Goldwaith Gold Gold what go Bobcat. Okay, Bobcat and uh, Paul Rubens, Pee Wee Herman, yeah, as a uh, drug cocaine sniffing uh, um, character in this thing, and uh, Penelope Cruz and Johnny. De I, I love this movie. I've seen it years. I'm gonna throw this in Blu-ray, and I'm sure the picture quality is gonna be killer. Uh, parental advisory rated R. Um, not not for the kitties. So if you are a kitty, yeah. And then the last one is what I'm finding. I guess is is going out of print, or or is out of print, or maybe going out of print. Or listen. If I'm giving you the wrong information, I apologize. But let's just say I had a hot time finding this title. I had a hot time finding it. I shopped and shopped and shopped. And I was trying to set my price at $5. Like everything that I wanted to buy from on Blu-ray to upgrade. Because I already own it on DVD. I paid full price already on DVD. I probably owned it before on VHS. I did not want to pay full price for all of these things. So I was trying to find a good deal for the upgrade. Okay, So please, as a collector, excuse me for, for trying to get a little bit of a, a budget. Because I've already spent a ton on on the, the dvds to begin with and money is a little bit tight it is that time of year but um uh i had a hard time finding this one and i was on the hunt for because i'm gonna be honest with you i had a hard time with this movie i i love sweeney todd i love i i, I i'm a big willy wonka fan so but i but i loved when he did charlie and the chocolate factory but i love when he plays those kind of characters like like the real dark offbeat odd characters and it's it's uh sleepy hollow i uh for some reason, I had a terrible, terrible time trying to find this title for under ten dollars. I was like, I want to, I don't want to spend more than ten dollars. I don't want to spend more than ten dollars. I went on Amazon. I want to say that they, it wasn't even available to buy on Amazon. I could be wrong. I'm trying to try and think. My, my, my mind sometimes, and I apologize if I'm giving you misinformation. But I tried to get on on Amazon, and I had a little bit of difficulty trying to find it for ten dollars or less. That's what I'm shooting for. Um, then I went on eBay and. Uh, I, sh I shop it around, and this this the guy, the same guy that bought all the rest of these titles from. Um, he was like, "I'll I'll throw that one in for for like I think it was like seven dollars or whatever." Um, and he did. He added it into the thing there. I guess it saved him money probably on the shipping of, of all the things. Um, and this, I was also worried that this wasn't going to be a legit copy because sometimes they, when things get a little scarce, a lot of the bootleggers like to start throwing some bootlegged stuff out. We are looking at a legit copy. It looks like 
um, Paramount. I mean, pa pa Paramount Films. We have a legitimate barcode back there, which always makes me feel good. The disc is silver, which always makes me feel good. And the cover art looks very minty and nice. But yeah, I I, I, I never was able to get into this film. I, I Maybe it was too much thinking in process. The, too much too much thinking. It was a thinker movie. You know, it's one of those where you're watching it and, and he's he plays like this... Um, uh, crime stopping scientist of some sorts, you know what I mean? Uh, which is a far cry from the uh, Ichabod and Mr. Toad that I used to watch as a kid from the Disney collection or whatever. Uh, that I used to watch on Ichabod. Oh, that's his name. You know that 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 one. There, I would watch over and over and over again. This one, it was a little bit off. Okay, it was it was a thinker. You know, this was a mystery piece, a horror mystery piece, and maybe my my mind could not grasp it back when it first was released. So I am going to give it a shot on blue, and uh, I'm I'm gonna watch it, and I'm sure it's going to be great because everything Johnny Depp touches turns to. Uh, to gold and i i have i've been on this johnny depp kick since i started listening to um i ordered the, the wait the right the right here hang on oh my face didn't crunch up too big there i ordered these not too long ago um uh hollywood vampires which is uh the johnny depp and um alice cooper and uh joe perry and forgive me there's another two guys in there the drummer and and i, I want to say the bassist I don't remember who they're, what they're from, but it's it's a super group, okay? But Johnny Depp sings, okay? And after seeing him sing on Sweeney Todd and watching all the bonus stuff on Sweeney Todd and learning that Johnny Depp's not really wasn't really a singer until he started doing Sweeney Todd and Cry Baby and everything. Then 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 I guess uh, Tim Burton gave him a shot doing Sweeney Todd. Didn't even hear him sing, and he was like, "Oh, I got, I'm gonna, I'm going to give him the job anyway because he's such a good actor." And so I was like, "I'm going to pick these things up. I'm going to check out some Johnny Depp singing." And he does a cover of Heroes by um, uh, David Bowie, and he does a uh, these are people who died, died. If you know that song, these are people who died. That, that song, uh, I don't, I don't know who the original uh, singer was. Uh, original person, the saying on the back of these things. I'm probably, I hope I'm not boring you, okay? But um, uh, wow, I can't, I can't even find the song. I'm just getting nervous. I, I, I got to slow down, okay? I don't want, I don't want to get you guys all upset. Uh, people who died, people who died. Yeah, it's, it's, it's back here. It does not say who the original singer is. I apologize. I love that song. I love it. It's been, I've had that thing on like my my eighties greatest hit albums. You know, if you got like the, those eighties compilation albums, it's been on there. But Johnny Depp sings it. Okay, I think Johnny Depp's got an amazing voice. Okay, I think I think he's an amazing actor. I think he's an amazing person. I I just I just am uh, in, is, can I use the word infatuated? I mean, him and Joaquin Phoenix. I mean, I'm like glued to the screen and, and Ryan Reynolds. Those those three guys right now are, are got to be my top guys. I'm like. I'm like glued to the screen whenever these these guys do anything, and uh, Hollywood vampires. If you never heard of them, they're 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 a rock supergroup. Alice Cooper, Joe Perry, and Johnny Depp on guitar and vocals. And wow, I mean, if you look it up on YouTube. Look up uh, Johnny Depp, Hollywood vampires, um, heroes, or, or uh, people who died, and you are going to be pleasantly surprised. I promise you, my friend. Uh, Please do me a favor. Please hit that like button. Please hit that subscribe button. And I'll, I'll see you on the next one. I'll see you. Wow. I'll see you on the next one. I'm, I'm, I'm quoting other YouTubers that I watch. All, and I'll see you later.